Mom, I'm so excited that Ryan's coming home after studying abroad. Me too, dear. I just can't believe your brother's bringing home a girl. Wait, what is that? Sounds like it's coming from the backyard. What now pronounce you? Husband and wife. My job here is done. Have a great day. Enjoy being married. What the? Ryan, are you getting married at your welcome home party? Yup. Everyone, meet my new wife, Louise. Hi, Brittany. Oh my gosh, the creepy neighbor. I'm officially Louise Plays now. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't believe my son is all grown up now. Ryan, oh my gosh, how did this happen? I thought you were in France. You know what they say, Britt. Paris is really the city of love. And I'm just so happy to be in this family. I've heard so much about all of you. Welcome to the family, Louise. Oh, I have a new daughter. This is amazing. Mom, don't you know who that is? That's our creepy neighbor. You know, the one who kidnapped me and you. Don't you remember? Britt, stop talking about my wife like that. You just met her. Now, come on, Louise. We got to go to the bank and merge our bank accounts with your millionaire one. Oh, well, yes, right away. Husband. <laughs> Brittany, I can't handle this. I, I'm sorry. What makes make me so emotional? Excuse me. I got to go buy them a wedding gift. I don't believe this. This is insanity, people. My brother married my creepy neighbor at his welcome home party? This makes no sense. He was studying abroad, overseas, in France. And when did he meet ah. Louise? I have to tell my best friend, Sophie. This is crazy. She won't believe this. I mean, I don't even believe this. Ah. What's the matter, sister-in-law? Stay away from me. I gotta go. Ah. How did you? Typically, you should give the bride a present on her wedding day. But I'm feeling generous for you, Brittany. I don't want it. You can keep it. Suit yourself. Coming, babe. See you around, Brittany. I'm just going to leave this here. Toodles, sis. Oh, my gosh. This is getting weirder and weirder and weirder. Should I open that gift, though? I, I don't know. I'm terrified. Who knows what my creepy neighbor could be up to? Okay, I, I guess I'll open her gift. What's this? Photo album? Oh, my pineapples? It's a family photo with me crossed out? What does that even mean? There's gotta be an explanation. Why did my creepy neighbor marry my brother? And what is she up to? I need to talk to him. He needs to end this marriage right now before it's too late. Wait, there's his car. Perfect. Oh, and there he is. Ah, get out of the car, Britt. Hey, Ryan. Hey. Hey, Britt. What's up? Dude, why on earth did you marry Louise? Uh, cause she's a millionaire? Want some pizza? I just put in an order. What? She is not a millionaire, Ryan. She's a French heiress. No, she is not. She's our creepy neighbor. She doesn't even have a French accent. Ah, fancy seeing you here, Brett. Louise, stop lying to my brother and tell him you're not a millionaire. Okay, Brett. I think you need to leave. Babe, I just think she's just jealous of how in love we are. No, I'm definitely not. You know what, Britt? Here's a thousand dollars. Go to the spa or something and relax. You seem tense. You know what, Louise? I really don't want your money. Oh, Louise, you're so sweet. Now, come on. There's a Lamborghini that I saw, and I think it would be the perfect wedding gift for me. <laughs> I'll see you around, Britt. Okay, what in the world? Louise is definitely not a French heiress. But my brother doesn't believe me. How am I going to convince him? I need to find a way to prove to him that Louise is lying and just being a creep like usual. I don't know if this is exactly going to work, but since Louise married into my family, that means I have the right to look at her bank account, right? I don't know. I'm gonna head to the bank and see if there's something they can do for me. I don't know, pull up like her bank records and prove that she's a liar and she's broke? Hey there, ex excuse me. Oh yeah, high score. Pardon me, hello? A person. Um, what do you want? Can't you see how busy playing a video game? Um, I need your help. And aren't you supposed to be working right now? Sure thing. Um, first things first, let me see some ID. Well, about that, it's actually not about my bank account. 
It's about somebody else's. Um, I'm not sure I can do that. Let me call my manager for you. Okay, thanks. Oh, wow. They have a really nice looking ATM. And a cozy couch. My manager will be with you shortly. Can I offer you some Perrier water? Oh, no, that's okay. This shouldn't take long. Um, lovely weather we're having. Yeah, really something. Did somebody call for a manager? Oh, yes, I did. <laughs> ah! Ma'am, is there something wrong? She wants access to someone else's bank account. So, this girl is trying to steal security! Me? Steal? I don't think so, Louise. You're the thief. We all know it. Take her away. Right away, ma'am. Come on, miss. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, Run wait, out of here. Uh, but hey! I'm here to inform you that you've been banned from the bank. Have a great day. Banned from the bank? Oh, I see you, Louise. You're up to something, and I'm going to figure it out. Mark my words. So there's absolutely no way that Louise is a millionaire. And honestly, I don't know why I didn't think of this before. My best friend Sophie is literally the greatest hacker of all time, so she will definitely be able to help me hack into Louise's account and prove to my brother once and for all that Louise is a fraud. So here we are at her house, and I hope she's home. It's happening! Oh! Um, jeez. Hey, Soph. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, uh, you know me. Just working on my... <laughs> you know, Soph, it's really not safe for you to keep your door unlocked like that. There are so many creeps around. What if I'm a criminal or a vampire and you just invited me into your house? Well, I'm Team Jacob anyways. So what's up? You are never going to believe it. My brother married my creepy neighbor, Louise. What the... Are. And my brother is convinced that Louise is like some kind of millionaire heiress or something. And that's the reason why he married her. So I need your help. You want me to hack into her bank account, don't ya? Oh, I love how predictable you are. To my hacker cave! <laughs> Alright, bestie. So, what's Louise's last name? Um, I think it's like McDermott or something? Um, Brit, not finding a Louise McDermott anywhere. I please. She probably was so excited to steal my last name. Bingo, big daddy. Now let me pull up her bank statements. Yes, yes. Okay, awesome, awesome, awesome. What do you have? Huh. She does have a bunch of money in her account, but it's a bunch of, like, random deposits. Do you think it's stolen money? Looks like it to me. How do we prove it? She needs to, like, admit it or something. Maybe that's what I can do. I can, like, get her to tell the truth. And then maybe my brother will divorce her, and then she'll have to move away and not be my creepy neighbor anymore. I'll be Louise free. Yeah. Um, I think this is going to be a lot harder than it seems, Britt. Good luck. You're going to need it. Oh, my gosh. I'm so excited to be moving into Brittany's house. I gotta pack this salad. Gotta make sure I bring my greens. Marrying Brittany's brother was the best idea I've ever had. What the? Hello? Hello? Am I being pranked? Yes, that was my chance to sneak in. Oh, gosh. This house gives me the total creeps. Let me run up to her room, though, before she gets back. I forgot it's a mini version of my room. Oh, this girl is such a creep. Ugh, stupid, annoying people. Not even a Girl Scout to sell me a peppermint patty. Anyway, back to packing. La, 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 la. Okay, now maybe I can snoop around her room and find some proof that she stole the money. This is gonna be hard. Gotta make sure I'm extra quiet and... Oh, what? Look at that. She has a framed heart picture of me in her room. Oh, I should throw that out. Nobody needs that. Wait a second. Over here. Looks like there's a book under her bed says, for Louise's eyes only? Perfect. This book contains bank accounts from random people. This has to be how she's getting all her money. This is amazing. This is literally just the proof I'm looking for. Now to bring this home. Whoa! No! No! No, 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 Brittany! You're gonna ruin it! You were supposed to be quiet! Well, well, well. Brittany, what a pleasant surprise. Yeah! Hey, girly! Um, I'm just actually gonna going now. What is that in your hand? This whole thing? Oh, it's just my um handy dandy school uh, 
Your book. Yeah, I can't, can't leave home without it. I'll be taking that. What do you think? I'm some kind of common idiot? Um. You think you can steal from me, huh? Huh? Oh my gosh, is that a pretty place plushie uh, over there? What? I've been waiting for the release. Yep, but you have coming soon. <laughs> I gotta go. Oh, pretty. Go, 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 go. Get back here. Ah! Ryan, 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 there you are. Whoa, dude, relax. Why are you yelling? Oh my gosh, what in the pineapples is that? Oh. Well, you know, since I'm a millionaire now, I gotta look the part. Ryan, that money is not Louise's. She stole it. No, you're lying, Britt. It's getting real old. Don't listen to her, Ryan. She's a liar, a liar. What? No, I found the proof and it's in your hand. I'll be taking that here. See for yourself. Whoa, wait a second. This is, this is crazy. This is nuts. That isn't mine. Can't you see that Brittany is trying to break up our lovely marriage? No, Louise, I want a divorce. My gosh, finally, took you long enough. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. Now get away from me. <laughs> All right, Britt, let's go home. Wait, what? What are you talking about? Didn't you hear my brother? Get lost. We don't want you around, Louise. Uh, not so fast. I said bye, Louise. I'm so happy to get rid of her and... You see, Brittany, your brother signed a prenup, and it stated that if we ever get divorced, then you become a part of my family. So you live with me now. What? No, you're lying. Why don't you read a little bit more in that book you found? Here, I got it for you. What? Oh my gosh, it says it right here. No, 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 that can't be legal. Can it? You don't come and live with me. <laughs> Just keep reading. Oh my gosh, then I'm gonna owe you a million dollars? Isn't it great? Let's go, Brittany. <laughs> So you won't be going anywhere, Brittany. I don't know what to do. I guess I should just try to make the best of this. Say, Louise, how did you end up meeting my brother anyway? Oh, I've been keeping tabs of everyone in your family. And I felt like marrying your brother was the best option. Now hand over the book. Fine, here. Why, thank you. Now, let me show you to your room. Wow. Okay. I've been working extra hard on it. What is this? Go in and see for yourself. Okay. Oh my gosh. Louise, this room is so creepy. Why are there millions of pictures of me? Oh, just a reminder of how beautiful you are. What? Is this not good enough for you? I'm such a failure. I thought you would love your own beautiful face watching you while you sleep. I know I like watching you while you sleep. Oh my gosh. What is this cat stuffed animal? That's Periwinkle. I've had him since birth. Okay, so this is my room. This, like, Britney cave? Yeah, but it's obvious that you don't like it. Louise, Louise, it, it's okay. Look, it, it's not that I don't like it. It's just terrifying to have a ton of pictures of yourself staring at you while you sleep. So, um, why don't you give me perms and maybe I can, like, adjust my room a little bit. Hmm, okay, good idea. But don't think you're smarter than me because I'm going to be standing right next to you while you build just to make sure you don't try any funny business. Yeah, you can count on me. Okay, here we are in build mode at Louise's house. I think I have an idea. Sure, I'm gonna fix this like terrifying Britney little cave. I mean, it, it's kind of flattering. These are cute pictures, but it's also so, so, so creepy. But I'm gonna build a way out. So that way, you don't have to be stuck here at Louise's forever. But it's gonna be tricky. If you can't see, Louise is literally right there, creeping right behind me. No pressure, just don't get caught or anything, right? I think what I'm gonna do is build a trap. It's gonna be one of those traps that Louise will walk over and like fall. Let me just delete the floor right here and just move my little nightstand thing over here. We're gonna build a wall. Oh, why is this not working? I think because there are things on the wall. All these posters of me on the wall are getting in the way of me building. And we're gonna build a basement right below this. I need the wall right here. I hate this glitch in Bloxburg. Like, what do you mean there's not enough space? Just build a little jail cell. 
perfect. And this will be like my little pathway to Louise. I mean, I'm not gonna be the one to let her out of this, but maybe her mom or her sister will wanna save her eventually. I know I don't. So actually, no. We're just gonna build this trap and we're gonna get rid of this and she'll be stuck down here forever. And that way she'll never be able to creep on me or my family again. I hope you like this basement, Louise. I'll make it like not terrible. I mean, I'll, I'll keep the walls pink. That would make me happy if I was stuck somewhere forever. But maybe a less aggressive shade of pink like this <laughs> light one here. Cool. Now to add a floor. So let me fill in the floor. And that'll be our trapdoor area. I need to build a floor over here. Color it like snow so nobody knows. I'm gonna put a table with a lamp though. I, I would feel bad if she was trapped down here and had like no form of light. And maybe a chair so she'll have somewhere to sit. You know what? No, I'll I'll give her one better. I'll give her a sleeping bag. Now to build the secret trap door. So now, trap. Are you done yet, Brit? I'm tired of standing. This shouldn't take you so long. Oh, yeah, yeah. One second, Louise. Oh, move, Brittany. Move, move, move. Um, oh, wait. Oh, my gosh. What I was doing to kind of get her to not be so suspicious. I'm gonna delete this bed. Delete that plant. I was gonna move it, but I guess I'll delete it. Move this over here and put in bunk beds. So that way we can have the ultimate bonding experience. Get this guy out of the way and she's gonna be so excited and wanna climb up the top bunk. Now just to change the bunk beds and make them pink. Oh, they're actually kind of cute, I'm not gonna lie. But I think we should be good, guys. You know, I'm just so happy you didn't run away. And honestly, I'm even more excited to see what you did to your room, bestie. Thanks, I actually came up with an even better surprise. You did? Oh, I'm so excited. I know how great of a builder you are because, you know, I'm always watching you. Yeah. Not creepy at all. Um, okay, well, let's not wait any longer and uh, come right this way. Okay, I'm following you. Come on, Louise, up to your room. Why don't you come on in and ta-da, bunk bed. Oh, my pineapples, Brittany, this is the greatest thing ever. I didn't think of this. We can live in the same room and be best friends forever and you'll never, and I mean never get away from me. Louise, I'm so glad that you like it. Now, I also left a little gift for you on the shelf over there. Matching sunglasses. Wait, what? Oh my gosh. Ah, they're beautiful. Ah, Pretty. Pretty. Ah, sorry, Louise, I can't hear you. Now, uh, I'll be needing this book of evidence and I'm getting out of here. Hopefully that keeps Louise away for good. And honestly, I still can't believe my brother married that crazy, creepy neighbor of ours. He is never gonna live this down. Brittany, come down here and meet my new boyfriend. Sebastian? Sis, are you dating my creepy ex-boyfriend? Duh, I deserve everything in this world, even if that includes your ex-boyfriend. Hi, Brittany. You look beautiful as always. Come on, Sebastian, take me shopping with your credit card. I'll be watching you. <laughs> I thought my ex-boyfriend got banned out of Bloxburg years ago, but apparently he's back and dating my sister. No, 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 this can't be. I'm gonna go up to my room and text Sophie. She won't believe this. <laughs> Sebastian, what are you doing? I thought you left to go shopping with my sister. I wanted to see you one last time before I left. I miss you. Well, stay away from me, you creep, and get out of my room. Sebastian, I want Gucci slides. Hurry up. Coming, Brenda. What in the pineapples is going on? My spoiled sister, I can handle that. But her dating my creepy ex, I can't handle that. No, 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 this is awful. So, so, so awful. But Britt, don't panic. Just text your best friend, Sophie. Here we go, and send. Oh, OMG, Sebastian's back. I thought he was banned from Bloxburg. Whoa, oh my gosh, Sophie, how did you get here so quickly? When my bestie's in trouble, I waste no time. Sophie, I can't believe this. Why is Sebastian dating Brenda? More importantly, why is Brenda dating Sebastian? I mean, does she remember who he is? I think so. I mean, she's so spoiled. She wants everything that I've ever had in life. So I think she's including my ex-boyfriend in this. Maybe you can talk to her and tell her exactly how creepy he is. 
And maybe that'll make her break up with him. It'd work for me. You're right. If she knows the full story, there's no way she'll want to date him anymore. Oh, yeah. Well, best of luck, bestie. CatCon is in town and I don't want to be late. See ya. Good luck. Yeah, okay. Everything's going to be fine. Just like Sophie said. I just have to talk to my spoiled sister and hopefully for the first time in history, she'll um listen to me. Hello, I'm home. Can somebody come carry my stuff upstairs? This means Sebastian's probably not with her. Now is my chance. Hey, Brenda, how was shopping? It was okay. We wanted to buy more things, but the mall was closing. Stupid mall. Hey, so I have to ask you, why on earth are you dating my creepy ex-boyfriend? Because why not? He buys me everything I want and does everything I say. But Brenda, he's bad news. He was banned from Bloxburg. The past is in the past. Now be a doll and carry these up to my room with a glass of lemon water at room temperature, please. I'm tired. I can't walk up the stairs. Oh my gosh, I can't believe Brenda. And Sebastian bought her all of those things? This is so weird. I gotta find a way to convince her that he is not a good boyfriend. Oh my gosh, after such a crazy night last night, I am treating myself to some pizza. Excuse me, I got a package for you. Um, I'm sorry, what? Can't you just deliver it to my house? Don't sass me, young lady. I'm just doing what Sebastian wants. Did you say Sebastian sent me this? My pineapples, just take the package and enjoy. Oh, and there's a card. Don't forget to read it. Have a great day. What the heck? What did my ex-boyfriend send me? Okay, and what is this about a card? Hold on, let me read it. It says, Brittany, my love, I've written a poem to show you how much I love you. Y'all, it is 50 pages long. How on earth do you fit a 50 page poem inside of a card? Hey lady, is that a present? Can I have it? I want it, I want it. Hold on, you want my gift? Yes, I want it now. Mine. <laughs> What is going on? Okay, I decided this is all way too much for me, so I am heading to the police. Maybe they can help me with this whole ex-boyfriend situation. Hello, officer? I'd like to report a crime. Name. My name? Oh, well, yeah, <laughs> I'm so sorry. Uh, it's Brittany. All right, ma'am, and uh, what crime are you reporting? My spoiled sister is dating my creepy ex, who, by the way, is now totally stalking me and giving me a love letter and poem that's 50 pages long. All right, all right. Is this some kind of a joke to you? No. Not at all. And he left a creepy photo of me and my best friend too. Take a look. Uh, what is it I'm looking at here? Oh, on the left, that's me. And wow, my hair looks really good in that picture. And on the right is the best friend. Oh my goodness. All right, I don't have time for your silly little girl drama. Now please get out of my line so I can help the next person. There's literally no one in here, sir. It's just me. Please, can you help? And besides, this is a serious crime. Your sister dating your ex is not a crime under federal or state law. Next, can somebody please get this girl out of here? But he's dangerous. And honestly, my sister kind of is too. You should probably see her driving. It is terrifying. Look up the name. His name's Sebastian Smith and he has been banned from Bloxburg. All right, well, fill out this form right here. Give me full detail as soon as you leave. I'll throw it in the trash because you wasted my time. You know what? Fine. If you're not going to help me, let's not even bother with the paperwork. Thanks for nothing. Wait! Yes? Say, you know this girl in the photo with you? Uh... Nope! No, I don't! Sorry! Gotta go! Hey, stamp right there! Since when is my best friend a wanted criminal? Well, that was a waste of an entire afternoon. Hey, Brad! Oh, Brenda, Sebastian, you guys. Oh my gosh, Brit, come here, come here, come here. Uh, what is it? Look at this new purse I'm getting. Brenda, that purse is $25,000. How on earth do you have that type of money? Uh, I don't. Sebastian! Yes, babe? Hi, Brittany, you look stunning as always. I want this bag now. Give me your credit card. Of course, here you go. Thank you. Sebastian, why are you doing this? This is a ton of money. Brent, shut up. Let him do whatever he wants. I just want to be as close to you as possible. I'd do anything to be in your life again. Um, uh, 
Sebastian, you're my boyfriend, not hers. And where's my vegetarian mushroom risotto with truffle oyala? Oh yeah, right, coming up. Care to join, Brittany? I made your favorite red velvet cake with cream cheese frosting. Uh, no, 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 <laughs> that's okay. I will pass on that. Come on, Britt, hang out with us. Ew, Sebastian, why do you want my sister to hang out with us? Her ugliness ruins my aura when she's around for too long. Like right now. Love you too, Brenda. Oh, come on, just five minutes. Oh, I love you, Brittany. What? Just for that, you owe me another purse or else I'm breaking up with you, Sebastian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get, get, get whatever you'd like, Brenda. You guys are giving me a headache. I'm going upstairs and going to bed early. Oh my goodness. If Brenda doesn't break up with him soon, I'm literally gonna lose my mind. <laughs> Perfect. I'm in. Time for phase two. La la la. La 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 la. <laughs> 1-1000, one, 2-1000. One thousand, two, one thousand. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Ah, no! There's a meal button on the thing! Ah! Ah, oh my gosh, what the heck is that noise? Is Brenda cooking something? What time is it? It's 3 a.m. How is anyone up right now? What is going on? Sebastian? What are you doing in my house? It is 3 a.m. Uh, 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 you saw nothing. We'll be reunited sooner or later. What? Where is Sebastian going? And what on earth was he doing in here? Did he make mac and cheese? What the heck? Brent, why are you talking? It's 3 a.m. Brenda, oh my gosh, it's Sebastian. He was just in here. He broke into the house. It's bad news. You gotta break up with him. And uh, make sure you shower in the morning. Shut up, Brent. No way. I'm not breaking up with him. He buys me whatever I want. I'm not just gonna let him go. Go back to bed. And if you wake me up again, you're dead meat. I can't go to bed right now. What did Sebastian mean when he said we'll be reunited soon? I don't like the sounds of that. What if he comes back? That's it. I'm not going to bed. I am staying up all night and watching over this house. I am not letting my creepy ex-boyfriend back in here. Good morning, bestie. Oh no, did I fall asleep? I wasn't supposed to fall asleep. Were you trying to pull an all-nighter? Yes, Sebastian broke into our house last night and I wanted to stay up just to make sure that he would not come back. It looks like I fell asleep in my chair. Bestie, why didn't you give me a call? I've been up for 48 hours now and I've never felt more alive. Sorry, I totally forgot you're in your no sleep era right now. Yeah, so I have an idea on how you can keep watch for your creepy ex-boyfriend. You do? Oh my gosh, Sophie, what is it? Hear me out, girly pop. How about we install the ultimate security system? State of the art, top notch, cameras, you name it. Honestly, I think that's an amazing idea. I don't know why I don't have security cameras to begin with, but I think now is the best time to start. <laughs> yeah, and obviously it's a good idea, Britt, because I thought of it. You know, it's true, you do have some good ideas every once in a while. But bestie, you have to admit, some of your ideas are not so great. What? Me one, I dare ya. How about that time we were having turtle races during fifth period? Um, about that time you chased the old lady with the ax because she stole your mac and cheese? Programming the school bell to play baby shark every time? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, those are still great ideas. Don't be such a hater. But I think we should start installing those cameras now. I'll hop into build mode. Okay, I think this one up here is the last of them. Now come on, let's go check out the footage on your PC. All right, oh my gosh, I'm kind of excited. Me too, I love modern day technology. So can I check the cameras? I mean, it's my house. Oh yeah, yeah, sorry, sorry, bestie. I just got excited. Okay, here we go. Oh, oh my gosh, wait. <laughs> Oh my gosh, what is Brenda doing? I don't know, but I'm so glad we put a camera in her room. We have another angle. Okay, this is amazing. She will kill us if she knew. I know, but seriously, Bestie, you gotta admire the confidence that girl has. But boy, she is spoiled. How many more purses does she have on those walls? Yeah, I don't know, but try living with her because she is the worst. Okay, so we have a good view of downstairs. Yeah, that looks awesome. One in a hall looks good too. All right, bestie, I think we're, <laughs> we're back to Brenda. 
<laughs> okay. I'm a bestie, hold on! Oh, 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 what is it? Jeez, manner, Soph. I need access to the cameras, of course. Uh, yeah, but Sophie, don't you think that's a little bit of, like, invasion of privacy? No, not at all. All right, now all I gotta do is send the link to my email and done! I got full access to your house. <laughs> Perfect! All right, bestie, I'm out of here. Call me if you need anything. Okay, thanks, Soph. I owe you one. Of course you do! Later, loser, we're going on a date. Ah! Oh my gosh, how long were the two of you behind me? And have... Have fun. Oh, we will. I'm forcing Sebastian to take me to that new Brazilian steakhouse for the minimum is $500 per person. Brenda, aren't you a vegetarian? You don't even eat meat. Yeah, but what a flex to say that I've been there before with that kind of price. Don't wait up. So, Brittany, what are your thoughts on getting back together sometime? Absolutely no way. <laughs> I was asking just to be nice. It will happen. We'll be together forever. That's our destiny. Sebastian! I don't want to be late for our reservation. Coming, my love. Which will be you soon. <laughs> oh, my pineapples. Sebastian is so creepy. And I hate that my sister won't break up with him. And I tried to convince her, but it's pointless. All right, well, I mean, if they're gone and my parents are on their anniversary trip this weekend, that means I'm home alone. What should I do? I'm gonna do something fun. <gasps> Maybe I'll call Sophie. All right. What the? Sophie! She ignored my call. What the heck? Oh, she sent me a text. She says that karate is running late. What a bummer. What am I supposed to do while I wait for her to get out of karate? I know. I'm gonna throw myself a dance party. So, let's decorate the house, people. Oh, I'm excited. All right, let's see what we got. For a dance party, we need a dance floor. So, we are gonna slap those right down there. Confetti cannons. There must be. I mean, is there really a party without a confetti cannon? I don't think so, people. I don't think so. We're putting up some disco balls, too. Woo! And I'm gonna put up a rotis machine. Beautiful speakers, I think. We'll put these massive party speakers out because we need to hear the good music. This one here. And I'll put this one here. Oh, actually, we're gonna move this to over by the telephone. I feel like that's a good spot. I mean, it's a lot of blocks, bucks, but I kinda want a DJ booth, so we're doing it. Whoa, <gasps> okay, this is epic, epic. Um, where do I even put this thing? Maybe not, it's a lot of money, and my parents will totally kill me if I spend all their blocks, bucks, so uh, we'll switch it up and just get it. Perfect, Scissors. yup. Party is gonna be everything. But like I said, I, I need something here. I think we'll do ooh, maybe a vintage jukebox. Yeah. Oh, we got two of them. So we're putting two of them out. Yes! I love it. Let's go see real quick. How's it look? Oh my oh my gosh, this is amazing. This is perfect. But what is this dance party missing? Some pizza. I gotta go get some! Oh, but before I head out, I'm definitely gonna check the security cameras real quick. No one's home. Back door looks locked. No one's in the hallway. No one's out front. All right, we're good to go. I am having the best time. I mean, I almost forgot about my spoiled sister dating my creepy ex. Woo! Whoa, hold on. What the heck? Is my house phone ringing? Like, who even uses a house phone anymore? Um, hello? Oh my gosh, you have to help me. Oh my gosh. Brenda, are you okay? Sebastian kidnapped me. He didn't take me to the Brazilian steakhouse. Where are you? I, I don't know. I'm afraid my phone's about to die and Sebastian is on his way to the house now. Brenda? Brenda! Oh my gosh, I don't know. This is the worst time for her phone to die. Oh no, I'm gonna go run upstairs. What is that noise? Oh my gosh, it's Sebastian. Oh my gosh, he's in the house. I gotta hide. Mom, in the closet. He'll never come in here. Or so I hope. Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, Brittany. Brittany? Brittany, where are you? Oh, she must have gone out. Hmm, well, <laughs> I'll just have to use her sister to lure her to me. <laughs> oh my gosh. He's gone. I need to find Brenda. Okay. I know this sounds crazy. I'm gonna follow Sebastian to see where he's going. Probably where he's hiding Brenda. I gotta move. Okay, so this must be where Sebastian lives. 
Now the only problem, guys, is I can't just like go up to the door and knock on it. I need to get in there without him knowing it's me. So I think I gotta go undercover. Go to undercover as a housekeeper, so I hope this works. There goes nothing. Hello, can I help you? Hi, oh, I mean, <coughs> hello. I'm uh, I'm just going uh, door to door in the neighborhood to offer my cleaning services. Huh, you have perfect timing. I'm expecting someone of great importance to me, and I want this house tip top shape and clean. Oh, uh, who are you expecting? My girlfriend. <laughs> She's perfect. Please come in. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. This, yeah. Um. This is uh. I definitely have my work cut out for me. Oh, what a lovely home. <laughs> All right. Well, I have to go pick her up right now. So I'll leave the money on the table and you just lock up when you're done. Guys, the poster. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds great. Bye. What the heck? The poster's a meal on the wall. Oh my gosh. This is terrifying. I don't have much time. I, I need to find Brenda. Look, Brit. Look. In the trash can. Oh, the living room? Oh my gosh, this place is a total mess. What's this? The floor looks totally different over here. <gasps> oh my gosh, a trap door. Hello? <gasps> Brenda! Ah! Who are you? What are you doing? It it's me, Brit. Brenda, I I'm so sorry. I I'm in a disguise. I guess it is actually you. Oh my gosh, we got to get you out of here. Thanks. I forgot to put on deodorant today. That's the worst I'd ever get. I've been locked in this dildo. Here. Let me get you out. But first, all these pictures of me. What the heck? I know, being surrounded by pictures of you is making me nauseous. Okay, let me try the door. Yes, it worked. Come on, Britt, we gotta get out of here. Now, where do you think you two are headed? Mm -hmm. ah! Oh no, Sebastian. That's it, I'm breaking up with you. Later. Yeah, what she said. <laughs> no, <laughs> you're not going anywhere, Brittany. Now that I have you here. Leave my sister alone. Come on, Britt, let's go. Yep, right behind you. Hop in, loser. Wait, we're stealing his car? Correction, I'm taking his car. Later, loser. What? Oh, Brenda. Oh, you, you can't leave me. My mom is calling. Hello? Brenda, get home immediately. Somebody has left a party at our house. And if I out it was either one of you girls you are in huge trouble um wrong number i think i gotta head to sophie's stop you can't marry her what is your sister doing here Brittany? you're ruining our wedding um uh, shall i continue you can't marry her she's a gold digger <laughs> i hate her andy get rid of her come on Britt. you need to leave how could you do this i'm your sister please listen to me go home Brittany. and i'll pronounce you husband and wife yeah. I can't believe this. This is amazing. I hate your family. They are the worst, especially your sister. Well, I'm sorry, babe, but you're a part of the family now. Yeah, and things are gonna change around here. Mark my words. Mom! You won't believe what just happened! Brittany, what's going on? Can't you see I'm working? Mom, you won't believe it! Andy just married Jessica! What? What did you just say? You heard me, lady! I wasn't even invited! I am his mother! Hey, Mom! Everybody, we're home! Oh, he has some explaining to do! Hey, Mom! Got some real exciting news! Yeah, I'm his wife now! And you didn't even invite your family! Yeah, about that! Sorry, Mom! But, uh, Jessica wanted it to be a small wedding. Yeah, only people that matter. I just, I can't believe this. I missed my own son's wedding. <laughs> Andy, what the heck? You made mom cry. Britt, it's fine. She'll get over it. Yeah, and how dare you judge my life decision? Oh gosh, I, I gotta go check on mom. You're a monster. You made my mom cry. I don't care what you have to say, Britt. I doubt you even love my brother. You just like him for his money. Duh, he's rich. And I love rich. Well, he's gonna find out the truth, you know. <laughs> No one is gonna believe you. Andy, I'm leaving! So, what do you think? It's our new home. Ugh, it looks smaller than it did in the pictures. Uh, well, if you don't like it, maybe I can buy you another one. <sighs> no, it's fine. I guess it'll work. I'm just still so mad because your family is awful. Now, I want a latte. Of course, whatever you want, my love. I I'll go get you one right now. <laughs> He's so dumb. I have him wrapped around my finger. Move it, lady. Move it, lady. Get out of the car. Come on. You're so slow. You are so slow. Jeez, Louise. I'm sorry, Soph. Come on. Let's go get lunch. Right behind you. Ooh, what am I?
am I gonna get today? A triple quarter pounder with extra cheese and onion rings and five colas. Yep, yep, I think that's it. Mm, I don't know what I want. I think I'm feeling just like some french fries. You! Are you kidding me? What are you doing here? <gasps> oh, no. We're living our lives, woman. Wait, do you know this girl? Unfortunately, I do. My brother's new wife. Ah, are you kidding me? I didn't even know your brother had a girlfriend. Well, that was fast. Are you stalking me? Stalker! Stalker! What? No, I'm not stalking you. Oh my gosh, yes you are. You're obsessed with me. You think you could talk to my bestie that way, lady? Manager! Manager! There's a stalker! Oh my gosh! Ah! Stalker! Call the cops! No! What? No, I I'm not stalking you. Brick, can I give her a piece of my mind? No, Soph. We'll just get going. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Excuse me, what seems to be the problem here? Officer, officer, oh my gosh, I am so glad you're here. Whoa, what the heck, though? That was wicked fast. I know, girl, you're talking. Officer, that girl is dangerous. Lock her up right now. All right, miss, I'm afraid you are under arrest. Stalking in Roblox is illegal. No, I wasn't stalking her. That's it, you're going downtown. <laughs> Quiet, criminal. Tell it to the judge. But please, officer, no. Free me. I, I did nothing wrong. What the heck? I need to get out of here. Officer, free my friend. Let her out of prison, you bozo. Oh, I'm on it. I'm not meant for prison. This place is scary. And it smells like cheese. And I want to go home really, really bad. Okay, you're free to go. What? Seriously? Yes, I'm free. And oh my gosh, Sophie, what are you doing here? Oh my gosh, there you are. You're free. I know, but what are you doing here with the mayor? Ah, oh, well, you see, Mayor Blackington here owed me a big old favor. Ah, oh, yes, I did. Now, are we even, Miss Sampson? Oh, not even close, buddy. You still owe me for those weeks I was your bodyguard. Oh, shucks. Well, I'll catch you later. Yeah, get out of here, Steve. Ah, oh, my gosh. I'm so happy to see you. And am I happy to see you. Oh, my goodness. I thought I would never get out of there. Thanks for freeing me. Hey, excuse me. I thought I told you two to get out of here. Woo! Okay, uh, let's finish this conversation outside, Sophie. That guy is so mean. I don't know what his problem is. Dude, speaking of problems, what is with your sister-in-law? I don't know. She had me arrested for no reason. Like, who even does that? Uh, Karen. That too. Yeah, maybe a Karen in training. I just don't understand why she hates me. Well, don't you worry, bestie. We are gonna dig up some dirt on her and expose her. And then your brother's gonna divorce her faster than I can swing an axe. You know that's my specialty. Oh, I'm getting a call. Hello? I'll catch you later, Sophie. I gotta go home. Mom, I got here as fast as I can. What's the emergency? Oh, <laughs> I mean, it's not really an emergency. Just your brother and his wife are here for family dinner. What? Hey, Britt. <gasps> oh my gosh. Britt, it's so good to see you. I'm so ready to have dinner. Yes, isn't this nice, Brittany? Now, come on, everyone. Let's sit down and eat. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, Britt. So, like, what's new, girlfriend? Oh, I don't know. You got me arrested today. <laughs> Uh-huh. Wow, Mom, this lasagna looks amazing. Oh, why, thank you. Now eat up before it gets cold. Actually, Mom, we have a huge announcement. Yeah, we're moving in. What? But didn't you just buy a new house? Yeah, but it's trash and we're having it rebuilt. Yeah, Mom, so please, can you let us stay? It won't be forever. You've got to be kidding me. Well, um, I, I wasn't really planning on this, but uh, sure. Amazing, and I think we should take Brittany's room because the closet's bigger. Wait, what? Yeah, and I have a lot of clothes. My gosh, no. No, absolutely not. No way. I'm not letting you take my room. I'm gonna lock the closet door. I'll never be able to come in here. This is my room. Excuse me. Look, I don't know what you're up to, but I know it's something bad. Ugh, this. I'm so tired of it. But we have to get along for your brother's sake. Well, if we're gonna be friends, then you can't have me arrested again. Ugh, what are we doing here? Yeah, can I open my eyes yet? What is this surprise? All right, here we are. Uh, what is this? Yeah, what's going on? Well, I thought it'd be fun if you two could spend some time together together, so I shut down the streets of Brookhaven, and you get to race. Oh my gosh, yes! <gasps> Please, tell me that pink car is mine! <laughs> yeah, you bet. Oh, I'm so gonna beat you. <laughs> I'm not racing, Jessica is. Um, what did you just say? I don't know how to drive! Oh, come on, you two need to get along, and this could be perfect. Plus, it was, uh, wicked expensive. Oh, I love expensive. Fine, a 
do it. So, Jessica, how about we make things a little bit interesting and we place a bet. If I win, you move out. And if I win, I get your closet. You're on. I am totally gonna beat you. All right, on your mark, get set, go. See ya. Woo! Oh my gosh, what the heck? How did she get in front of me? Uh, come on, come on. And I won. Yes, woo! <laughs> I did it. <laughs> wow, Britt, way to go. That was so much fun. But uh, we might want to check on your wife. I think she crashed her car. Oh my gosh, what the heck? Come on. Ah! Oh my gosh, what the heck? You cheated, Brittany, you cheated! What are you talking about, no? Yes, you did, you made me crash. Yo, Britt, seriously? That's so messed up. How could you do that? What the heck? No, I didn't. I didn't even come close to her. You know what? Maybe this wasn't the best idea. Maybe we should try something else. Yes, this is so much more my style. Now, is there a budget? No, honestly, get whatever you two want. I just want you to bond. Oh, heck yeah. Oh my gosh, look at this, Britt. Oh my gosh, you should totally buy that because that's better than anything you've ever owned in your entire life. Jeez, it's a shame this store doesn't sell personalities because you need one. Ha, yeah, funny. Okay, let's play dress up and pick out an outfit because you're in desperate need of a makeover. What the heck? Hey, I like my outfit. Yeah, you're the only one in the universe. Come on. Rick, come on. I want to see the outfit I picked out. Okay, um, what do you think? Oh my gosh, you look super trendy. Andy, what do you think? think of my new fit. Y you look, um, uh, I'm sorry. I'm getting a call. G gotta go. <laughs> you look so ugly. <laughs> well, I'm glad you're having fun with this. Oh, I'm just getting started. Just you wait. Excuse me, employee. Yes, ma'am. Oh my gosh, you two look incredible. Shut up. This woman is stealing. Get her in trouble now. What? No, I, I would never steal. Especially not an outfit like this. Oh my goodness. Get out now. Okay. Jeez. Your sister got us kicked out of the store for stealing and she tried to blame me. Are you kidding? Seriously, Britt? Let's go home, Jessica. But guys, hey, wait. No, I didn't do any of that. And she's just terrible. I mean, she's never once said anything nice to anyone in my entire family. Well, um, I won't be saying anything nice on Yelp if you don't give me the haircut I'd like. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm sorry. I just thought you'd be interested in my life. Nope, I'm leaving. Hey, Britt, I would like a mohawk that's green. Yeah, sure. Oh my gosh. Oh, I've had the worst time with my sister-in-law. You won't believe it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just shut up and do my hair. Uh, okay. Uh, there you go. Yep, looks great. <laughs> Soph, hey. Rick, I see you. I'm sorry, Soph. I'm at work. I'm a little busy here. Can it wait? No, girl, you need to see this. Come on. Jeez, oh, okay. I'll be right back. What is it, Soph? This way, over here. What is it? Look, over there, on the bench. Go talk to those people. Okay. Hi there. Um, Soph, who are these people? They're Jessica's parents. Oh, oh no, no, no. Don't say her name ever. Ah! Terrible. Oh my gosh, wait, why are you two so scared? Oh, Mary, I don't, I don't know what to do. I don't know, Tammy. I never wanted to hear that name again. Neither did I. She made us go bankrupt. Bankrupt? You heard it here first, Britt. Oh, no, 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 no. This is awful. She's totally gonna do that to my brother. Oh, yes. If she married your brother, she will ruin his life. Oh my gosh, are you serious? How do I get rid of her? You can't. You're in big trouble now. It's true. Oh my gosh, will you two help me break her and my brother up? I mean, you're her parents. You, you gotta know how she ticks. Oh gosh, no, definitely not. I will not go near that monster. Neither will I. I'm so scared. She could be listening right now. Oh my gosh, yes, you're right. We gotta get out of here and fast. Wait, hey, no, guys. Gosh, so this is awful. What are we gonna do? I don't know. I feel really bad for them. We need to break them up right away. Man, where could Jessica be? I've been searching Brookhaven forever. Ugh. Wait, hey, uh, little kid, I have a question for you. What do you want? Well, I'm looking for someone. Do you think you could help? If you pay me a hundred dollars. Jeez, a hundred bucks? Uh, fine. <laughs> Thanks, lady. Okay, so now that I paid you, have you seen a girl? She has like real bad attitude, brown hair. She's always complaining about everything. Yes, I have. She's at the hub. Oh my gosh, thank you. To the hub. They gotta be upstairs. Oh my gosh, <gasps> I hear them. Let's get out of here, Cassandra. This place sucks. We're never getting our food. 
food. Oh my gosh, yeah. Let's go. Where are they off to now? I gotta follow them, but I have to be careful. I can't get caught. Looks like they're heading to the diner. All right, Britt, just stay hidden and you'll find all the evidence that you need. Hopefully she doesn't see me. Oh my gosh. Jeez, that salad's expensive. Yeah, but like, don't worry. My new husband is so rich. I gotta record this. So like, I was being married anyway. Loki hates his family and I'm just using him for his money. All I need to do is just keep him away and I'll get whatever I want. Gosh, yes, this is perfect. I cannot believe she literally just said that about my brother and my family, but this is perfect evidence. Um, wait a minute. <gasps> what are you doing? Stucker! Oh, um, nothing. What is your hair? Yeah, tell us. Uh, I'm not who you think I am. You're an idiot, Ray. What did you hear? Wouldn't you like to know? I'm out of here. Bye. Yeah, what my friend said. Wait, what just happened? Ugh, you idiot! That was his sister! And she's gonna ruin everything! So, like, does that mean I don't get dinner? No, Cassandra! No dinner for you! Ah, you're so stupid! I don't know, Mom. What if he gets mad? It's the right thing to do, Brittany. That girl is terrible. You're right. Hey, Mom. Britt, what's up? Oh, um, hey, Andy. Oh, um, what a wonderful day, is it? <laughs> yes. Okay. What is going on? You two are acting real sus. Brittany has something to show you. Mom. Yeah, I, I do. Here, um, let me just play you something real quick. Loki hates his family, and I'm just using him for his money. Did you edit this? There's no way she said that. I know, but no. I didn't edit it. Sorry. Son, are you okay? Uh-oh. Oh, dear. Andy, are, are, are you all right? <laughs> oh, my gosh. Ew. Is Andy crying? Yeah, friend, we just told him that Jessica's using him for his money. No kidding. Isn't that pretty obvious? Andy, don't be so upset. <laughs> it's okay, dear. Sometimes love blinds us. It'll all get better. I just thought she really loved me. Well, we love you, Andy. It'll all be okay. You'll get through this. <laughs> you think? Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. Now, how about I make you some steak to cheer you up? I know how much you love it. Thanks, Mom. That's what moms do. Now I have to break up with my wife. <laughs> and Brent, you're coming with me. What? No, do I have to? Okay, but like, do you really need me to be here for this? Yep, of course I do. Oh, man. Wait, wait, wait. Stop. Is that the car you bought her? What the heck? Yeah, you're right. Britt, come on, get out. Oh, man. I don't want to be here for this. Jessica, hey, I need to talk to you. <gasps> oh, hi. Um, Can we talk after Cassandra and I finish our shopping spree? No, I want a divorce. We're breaking up. Oh, my gosh. I heard divorces are contagious. I'm out of here. Bye. What the heck? What is going on? You. Look, I heard everything. You're trying to take me away from my family, and you're using me for money? You don't even love me. Um, that's not true. Listen to this. I heard it all. Well, that isn't me. Don't lie to me. We all know it was you. Fine, it's true. I hate you and your dumb family. I want a divorce. Uh -huh. Hey, where do you think you're going? Oh my gosh, the door won't open. <laughs> yeah, I reset the keys. That car is mine. You are the worst. I hate you. I hate you. Ah! Oh, boy. That went well. Um, what are you doing? <laughs> Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> you think you can break up with me? <laughs> I have this credit card, and we're going on vacation. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yes. Love a vacation. Honestly, I'm just happy to spend time with you now. Yeah, I agree. And I'm sorry she tried to get between us. Don't worry about it. We're family. We'll always stick with each other. Excuse me. Your card's been declined. Oh, huh. I'm sorry. Can you run it again? I've already ran it five times. And every time it says declined, you have no money. Oh, man. Uh, I'm sorry. Is there anything I can do? Yeah. You poor losers can get out of here before I start throwing ice cream at you. I'll count to three. What? Oh my gosh, okay. Whoa, this guy seems serious. Andy, let's get out of here. Two and a half. Oh gosh. Ah! Oh, yep, here it is. It looks like there's a chart for a uh, Trinity Europe. It's roughly $25,000. You gotta be kidding me. Uh, that wasn't me. It was my ex-wife. Well, she's still on the account, so sorry. <laughs> oh 
what the heck? Wait, Andy, hold up. You gonna be okay? I can't let her get away with this, Britt. Well, what do you wanna do? Look at her over there, spending your money. Britt, I don't know about this. I don't know if I can do it. What? Andy, oh my gosh, of course you can do it. All right, if you say so, come on. Got this, brother. Um, excuse me, what's going on here? He's getting a pedicure. His feet are real rough and he could definitely use it. What the heck? Thanks, Britt. But no, that's not why I'm here. Jessica, can we talk? I'm whatever. And I gonna just uh, sneak towards the door and listen in a little bit. I don't know how to say this other than I miss you. I want to get back together. Oh, really? Yeah, you're the best wife in the entire world. I miss you so much. Well, I'll only get back together with you if you give me money. 50 million dollars. What? <laughs> Are you serious? Duh, I'm serious. Well, only my mom has that type of money in her safe. I don't have that much. Wait, wait, wait. You're telling me your mom is rich? Are you serious? Yeah, Uh, we just don't talk about it. Mm -hmm. Bye! So, do you think she bought it? I don't know. What do you think? Well, honestly, you're a terrible actor, but I think she fell for it. And now we have to set the trap. Oh, man. You've been hanging out with Sophie way too much. Are you sure this is gonna work? 100%. We just have to wait. She should be here any... Oh, my gosh. Yes! Jessica, what the heck are you doing? You're pretty dumb. What? I'm hacking your mom's bank account and taking all of her money. I knew you were a gold digger. And so what? I love money, and there's nothing you can do about it. Oh my gosh, perfect. Oh my gosh, officer. Yay, I'm so excited you're here because my ex-husband is denying me my money. No, it's not true. She is a thief. She only married my brother for money, and she literally was just trying to steal money from our mom. Stealing money from Mrs. Brittany, please? She's a nice lady. Lady. Whatever, it's my money and I want it now. Look, lady, I know the law. Stealing is stealing. And I also know that you are a wanted criminal. I'll put you in jail forever. No, I'm, I'm not going to jail. No, no, no. <laughs> Get back here. W what are you doing? Yeah, you can't run away. You deserve to go to jail. Once my dad got married, things seemed normal until I found out my stepmom was evil and she had a plan to ruin Brookhaven. So I had to find a way to stop her. Oh man, I'm so excited for my dad. This is a big day for him. He's finally getting remarried. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Congratulations. I wish you a lifetime of happiness. Yay, I am so happy. Oh, I love you, darling. Life will be perfect together. This is the greatest day of my life. Well, besides the day Brittany was born. <laughs> All right, folks. Well, now it's time to party. I am so ready for this. I can't wait. I get to ride in a fancy limo. Oh, this is just going to be amazing. Let the party begin. I've been wanting a new mom, and my stepmom seems so, so nice. Hey, you, kid. Oh, uh, yes, Sally? What's up? Or shall I say, new mom? Stepmom? Oh, so exciting, huh? Never call me that ever again. But why? I mean, my dad just married you. You're my stepmom now. I said never again. Now that I'm in your life, things are changing around here. What do you mean? I mean, sure, it's gonna be exciting having you in the house and stuff like that, but I, I don't think really much is gonna change. Are you not listening to me? I think I'm confused. Confused? Huh, you haven't seen anything yet. Take this! Ah! <laughs> Stupid brat. Oh my gosh, Britt, are you okay? Oh, darling, she needs help! I, I heard you scream. What's happening? Ow, Dad, my eyes are like burning. Ow! Don't worry, darling. I, I can take care of this. Oh, my poor daughter. Can you believe it? O are you sure? Absolutely. Now go thank the pastor for the ceremony and I'll figure all of this out. Oh, guys, I'm like seeing spots. Oh, my head hurts too. I'll leave you to it. You're the best. I'm sorry, Britt. Hope you feel better. Now you're coming with me. What? Everything hurts. Sally, why would you do that? Ow, that, that's so mean. And where are you taking me? I hope to the hospital because my eyes need to be checked. Ow! <laughs> Sally, you can't just drop me in the middle of the street. Come on, help me out. The hospital's that way. There's more where that came from, so you better stay out of my way. You got that? 
Oh my gosh, guys, there is nothing better than watching this show on TV. I mean, look at that puppy. He is so cute. Actually, you know what is better? Is making sure that you are subscribed to my channel right this second. And also, go subscribe to my new channel, Brittany Plays Roleplay. It's awesome. You can find the link in the description. But look at that face. Oh my gosh, so cute, so cute. <laughs> oh, wait a minute, hold on. <laughs> This will be so easy. <laughs> My stepmom and her friend are kind of laughing a little evilly over there. I wonder what they're talking about. This plan is bound to work. It's too good to fail. <laughs> Oh my gosh, yeah, I know. It's the best plan ever. I gotta listen in here, people, cause what plan are they talking about? Are, are they planning on like changing their book club night? I, I don't really know. Let's listen. Ruining everyone's life is too easy. I know, this is gonna be foolproof. I've always wanted to ruin everyone's life and well, here's our chance. Wait, they have a plan to ruin everyone's life? This doesn't make any sense. I, I can't believe it. Hey, do you hear something? Wait a minute. Look, over there. Ooh, busted. Oh, no, 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 this isn't good. What do you think you're doing? Oh, I I'm stretching my legs. There's a commercial break on the dog show, and uh, yeah, that's it. <laughs> you were listening in. Yeah, that's a likely story. I can't believe you. No, um, I, I didn't hear anything. Trust me, uh, nothing at all about ruining anyone's life. Nope, just minding my own business here. This is an adult conversation. Kids like you can't hear about it. I know it's wrong to overhear people's conversations. Sounds like she's admitting to listening in to me. You, so you were listening. Wow, that does it. I've had enough. Get out. What? No, you can't be kicking me out, no. Get out now. You heard her, kid, get lost. Get out or I'll throw you out, you understand me. Get lost, loser, <laughs> bye. Fine, I I'm out of here, can't believe it. My evil stepmom just threw me out of my house? Just wait until my dad hears about this. He is not gonna believe it. I'm not even her kid, so like, does she even have the right to throw me out of the house? I think not. So I'm gonna rush over. Dad, oh my gosh, dad, dad, hey! Hey, oh, I have to talk to you, this is urgent. Britt, what, what's going on? Dad, you won't believe it. Sally, your new wife and my new lovely stepmom kicked me out of the house. Can you believe that? What? <laughs> oh, no, she didn't. Come on, Britt. I'm telling the truth. She screamed at me and kicked me out in front of her friend. You could even ask her friend. Oh, come on now. There's no way she would do that. You're being silly. Sally kicked me out. She said she had enough of me and wanted me out. Oh, Britt, I know change is tough, but oh, Sally, hey, how are you? Whoa, 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 hold on. What is she telling you? Oh, you know, how you kicked me out of the house? Oh, darling, she's talking silly. Did, did you really kick her out of the house? And I bet you didn't even tell him why I had to kick you out, Britt. Because you were being mean, and you said you had enough of me. Wait, wait, hold on. <laughs> you actually kicked her out of the house? Sally, what happened? The truth was, Britt was screaming at me, and she wouldn't listen to me. I told her to turn down the TV, and she wouldn't. She flipped out. She lost all control. No, that didn't happen at all. She, she's lying, Dad. She's lying. Then, you won't believe it, honey, she tried to set the house on fire, and this girl, she went crazy. Are you serious? What? I, I, I can't believe it. Brittany. I'm sorry. I, I had no choice. I had to tell her to leave. I, I felt threatened and endangered. I cannot believe you would do this, Brittany. I am so disappointed in you. You can't believe this. You know me. I'm your daughter. You raised me. I would never set my house on fire. That's crazy. She's making this all up. And look at her, trying to call me a liar. It, it, it's so difficult for you to have a new mom, but this is too 
far. There's no way she would ever lie about something like this serious. I would never lie. I'm sorry, Britt. Hurts me to say this. But you need time to figure this out and away from our house. Sorry, you're out. What? Seriously? I can't believe you guys. You're the worst. Kicking me out of my own house? What does one do when they get kicked out of their house? They go to their best friend's house, and I can't wait to tell Sophie all about this. She will not believe it. Huh? Hello? Huh? Hello? Sophie, girl, I am so glad to see you. Brit! Hey, girl, what's up? Can I come in? I have some tea to spill for you, girl. Oh my gosh, yeah, of course. Come on in. You won't believe it. My evil stepmom kicks me out of the house. What? Are you serious? Sophie, can I stay with you? Uh, duh. You're always welcome in my house, bestie. That's a huge sigh of relief. I had no idea where else to turn other than you. I can always count on you. I mean, even my dad believed that I, like, set the house on fire. I'm not capable of that. You know me better than anyone else. He did? Is he insane? Did he bump his head? Absolutely not. Britt, you're nervous about everything. That's why you have me. I'm the crazy friend that sets things on fire. So, do you mind if I bring the suitcase upstairs? Yeah, sure. Go unpack. <sighs> Thanks, because it has been quite the night. Ooh, <gasps> wait a minute. Sophie, which bed is yours again? Um, uh, whatever. I'll just put it by the safe. Here we go. That's <gasps> oh, no. Oh, my gosh. Sophie! Sophie! Your house! It, it's on fire! Brad! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh! We need to get out of here! Did you leave a Pop-Tart in the oven again with the wrapper on? Oh my gosh, no! Not this time! Your house! <laughs> I know that laugh from anywhere. Brad! Over there! <gasps> Dally, how could you do this? <laughs> All according to plan. Oh, that woman's the worst! I can't believe that's it, you crazy lady. You went from my house. Why? Why? I ought to cry about it some more. Why don't you? Uh oh, uh oh, uh, gotta go. Get back here. You get back here, you evil woman. Get back here. Man, Sophie, she got away. Brit, we need to stop her. That's it. That woman has crossed the line. Yeah, no one messes with my best friend. Okay, so now my dad totally has to believe me because I have Sophie here as a witness as to how evil my new stepmom is. So I hope we can talk some sense into him. I mean, my dad's really stubborn, but you know, hopefully he understands. I mean, she lit your house on fire. Girl, I know. Let's go talk to him. All right, here we go. Dad. Uh, dad? Sophie, this is really weird. Where in the world is my dad? Hold on, the slider is open. Wait a minute, dad? Okay, so is it just me or is that really weird? My dad's just standing in a corner. Uh, yeah. Brittany, please, dad, hello? What are you doing? Dad, hello? <gasps> oh my gosh, um, are you okay? Um, Brit, dad don't look too good. Sophie, um, step away from my dad. I I'm pretty sure he's possessed right now. H hello? Lights on in there? H hello? Pretty place, Dad. Hello? Hello? Do, do you see me? Dad, are you are you listening? Oh my gosh, Sophie. I, I, I don't know what to do. Okay, okay. Uh, let's try this. Hello? Pretty place, Dad. Hello? <laughs> um, Sophie, I don't really think spraying him with an extinguisher works. <laughs> Let's run. Good idea. Let's go, Sophie. Oh my gosh, my dad is possessed. What's happening? I can't believe it. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Wait, hold up. Get in the car. No time to explain. Get in. Okay, okay, okay. Ah, buckle up, Sophie. Uh, excuse me, sir. Where are you taking us exactly? We've been in this van for like 45 years. My goodness. Hey, yeah, hop on out. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, who exactly are you? Yeah, buddy. Look, spill the beans, all right? We don't have time for this. All right, all right. Look, I'm just glad I got you guys in time. I'm not messing around here. You're in great danger. You got that? Yeah, dude, no kidding. I mean, my dad is possessed. You saw him. I mean, whose dad has circly crazy eyes and chases after them? Not a normal dad, that's for sure. Yeah, I mean, that happened to my dad once, but not normally. 
Well, it doesn't end there, all right? Now that Sally's your stepmom, prepare for the worst. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry. I don't really think it can get any worse than this, right? The worst is already here, dude. I mean, my house is gone. Burnt to a crisp. There's no way it can get worse. No, I'm telling you, this is just the beginning. She ruined my life. Oh my gosh, so you know firsthand how evil this woman is. Yeah, she totally ruined my family's life. Wow, this lady, she spreads her crazy everywhere. My goodness, I'm sorry to hear about this, dude. Yeah, I'm so sorry. What the heck? <gasps> oh my gosh, dude, your car's on fire. Oh my goodness. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. <gasps> Sally. Oh no. You're a fool for getting in my way. Um, Sophie, back up. She, she's she got a taser. Oh, gosh, okay, yeah, yeah, backing it up a bit. Don't you take another step. Sophie, I'm gonna just hide behind you, um, because you have the ax, and I'm, I'm petrified, and I don't know what to do. You're not gonna get away with this. Oh, yeah? <laughs> and who's gonna stop me? Oh! Uh. Get out of here. See you girls soon. <laughs> uh, Sophie, Sophie, oh, wait up, wait up. Oh no, Sophie, this isn't good. Another fire? Girl, your stepmom is crazy. Yeah, her and her friends plan to ruin everyone's life seems to be working right now. I, I can't believe this. Well, as crazy as all this is, we have to do something. Yeah, girl, we, we got to come up with a plan. But I, I I don't know. What do we do? Well, kids sure knew a lot, right? Oh, my gosh. Yeah, that poor guy. We should probably save him and try to get to the bottom of this. He definitely seemed like he had a lot of valuable information. Okay, okay. I can focus on saving the kid. Well, you have to do something about your crazy stepmom, though. I know. But, Sophie, like, what do I do? I don't know how to stop her. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, this is a tough one. She does have a taser, so we gotta be careful. Oh, 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 oh. I thought of it. I know, I know, I know, I know what you should do. Just follow her. Be sneaky. I don't know about that, Soph. I mean, sounds like a good idea, but she's next level crazy. So, um, what about I just, like, pull my dad and hopefully he's not possessed and uh, we can talk this through. I mean, like adults. Adults do that, right? They, they talk about things. Girl, your dad is not an option anymore. He's possessed! <sighs> I know, I know, I know, but I really don't want to follow this evil stepmom of mine. Go follow the crazy lady. Do it, do it, do it, do it. I mean, Brit, do I have to start a chant here? I mean, it's, it's just me, so it's not really going to be a good chant. <sighs> you know what? Fine. What was that noise? Did you hear that? Um, it sounded like it was coming from upstairs. Stairs. Uh, is your mom home? Uh, my mom doesn't live here, so... What do you think it could have been? Hello? Is anybody up there? <gasps> Sophie? You said your mom didn't live here. Well, what's she doing upstairs? M mom? She has that same scary possessed look that my dad had. Uh-oh, um... Oh, and this isn't good, oh. <sighs> Mom, you broke into my house again? The laundry day is not until Thursday, and that's when you can come in and clean my clothes. Sophie, I don't think she's here to do laundry. Um, what should we do? <sighs> Brit, go find the kid. Uh, I'll, I'll take care of this. Oh, uh, well, um, good luck. Yeah, this seems like a family issue, and, uh, I'm gonna get out of here. Uh, good luck, be safe, uh, gotta go. Oh my goodness, I don't know what's about to happen, but I am scared for my friend here. Why am I in this bush, you may ask? Well, good news. I was able to track down my stepmom and she's at her evil best friend's house. Her friend is like Sophie, but like 40 times more evil. And at least Sophie has good intentions. Sure, she runs around with an ax and is kind of a lot sometimes, but my evil stepmom's best friend is way worse. All right, so 
Let's see what they're doing. Hopefully they don't see me. We're the greatest. Oh yeah. We're the greatest. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Woo! Look at our moves. Woohoo! Our plan's working. Oh yeah. We're gonna ruin everyone's life. Mm-hmm. Girl dance party. Woo! Seriously? My stepmom and her friend are having a dance party right now because they're ruining everyone's lives? Evil. I mean, I love a good dance party, but come on. All right, all right, let's get serious. Yes, yes, you're right. Enough fancy moves for now. We'll post that TikTok later. They were filming a TikTok? Wow. You know, that was really a close call. That stupid brat almost ruined everything for us. Can you believe? I know, but now that he's out of the way, he'll be smooth sailing from here. <laughs> I wonder what they did with him. Oh, oh. That reminds me. Did you bring the mind control solution? Mind control solution? So that's their evil plan. <gasps> of course I did. You think I'm dumb or something? Actually, don't answer that. Please, please. On the sake of our friendship, don't answer that. Hold on, hold on. Let me go get it. Be around here. Oh, yep, yep. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> this will be our best moment yet. Time to make our move. <laughs> All right. Oh man. Uh, I I gotta hide. I I I gotta get out of here. I, what what do I do? Um, uh, maybe maybe this bush. <gasps> oh oh no. Hey. What the? Oh um. Hi there. <laughs> Not this dork again. Are you serious? <gasps> um. Hi there. Uh, just going door to door selling um magazines not spying on you or anything. Guys, when will I learn my lesson? I am not good at spying on people. Let Sophie talk me into this again. What a dumb excuse. I've had it with you. Yeah, also, you're not good at lying to people. My gosh. No, stepmom Sally, please, please put that down. Put that down. Say good night, you little brat. Whoa, wait a minute. Um, where am I? I I'm handcuffed in this weird basement. What is going on? I, I gotta get out of here. I gotta go save Sophie. I, I don't know if she's okay. And I just, I need to get out of here. I can't believe this. Sally. Oh, <laughs> look who's awake. <laughs> How was your little snooze? Look, Sally, you're not gonna get away with this. Whatever do you mean? Get away with what? Look, I heard you talking with your friend. I know what you're up to with mind control solution. Why would you do such a thing? Oh, yeah, that! <laughs> it's not funny. You can't poison Brookhaven. What are you gonna do with that solution? Oh, I can't wait. Once the town is poisoned, I'm gonna steal everybody's money and I'm gonna be the richest in the whole universe. <laughs> and starting with your dad. <laughs> what? No! Leave my dad out of this. I can't believe you tricked him. He really cared for you. You evil person. Don't care. Really, seriously, honestly, don't care. How could you? Please, just don't do this. The town doesn't deserve it. You can't stop me. No, but I can. <gasps> dad! Huh? Oh, oh darling, hey! You're not going anywhere. I heard everything. I can't believe you. Huh? Oh, you heard all of that? Uh, well, um, uh, it was, a uh, just a joke. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> a joke. Uh, funny, right? You're not fooling me. You tricked me once, but never again. I'm gonna call the police. I can't believe you. Yeah, Sally, my dad's gonna stop you. Thanks, Dad. Saving the day. <laughs> not so fast. <gasps> what? Uh, what? Oh! <gasps> Dad! I now pronounce you husband and wife! Oh my gosh, yay! I can't believe it! We're finally married! Not if I have anything to say about it! Mom? Go away, old lady! You weren't even invited! You are the worst! 
I hate this girl. You can't marry her. She's a criminal. What? No, I'm not. You're just a crazy cop, and you're too late. We're already married. You're coming with me, mister. What? Mom, what are you doing? Hey, give me back my husband. Oh, my gosh. What on earth just happened? Mom, put me down. Not a chance. Mom, and you stay in there. Oh, my gosh. What is going on? Your brother just married that terrible girlfriend of his. What? How did we not know about this? Come on, please let me out. What the heck? Mom! Oh, uh, where is my husband? Where is he? I'm in here. The door's locked. Uh, no, it's not. It's locked from the inside, you idiot. Oh, you're right. Now, come on. I want to leave. Wait, guys, hold on. You're married? Well, duh. And none of us were invited? Seriously? That's because your mom hates me. That's right. I do hate you, you criminal. Crazy old lady! You're just mean! Well, you're just stupid! Well, I can't have this! <laughs> Please, Mom, babe, stop! Oh, I'm sorry, dear. Mom, look, I love my wife. And you need to accept it. Yeah, Mom, what's the big deal? Brittany, I am a police officer. I know she's a criminal. You don't know anything. You just hate me, and I hate you! Now, come along! We're going! What? Hey, what? Come on! That girl is the worst! Mom, I think you're just jumping to conclusions here. No, I know that girl is a criminal, and I will prove it. Why don't you just try giving her a chance, Mom? I hate that girl, and that is that. Wow, Chef, all of this food looks incredible. Why, yes, I believe everything is to your liking, Miss Brittany. Oh, absolutely. Look at this. Everything is perfect. Thank you so much. Now, what is all this for? Is it a very special day celebrating anything? Bella, yeah, you could say that. <laughs> Fabulous. Well, if there's anything else I can do for you, just let me know. Off to the kitchen. Brittany, what is it? I'm very busy down at the station. <gasps> oh my goodness. Ta-da! What is all of this? This is just a little special lunch to celebrate the women in our family. Here, look, there's a chocolate fountain. <gasps> it's like a dream come true. This is so sweet, dear. Is your sister coming? Oh, no. She said it was lame or whatever and wanted to paint her nails instead. I don't know. Well, then, should we get started? Not just yet. We're waiting on one more person. Who are we waiting for? Oh, no. No! Brittany, I'm so excited to have lunch with you. Uh, um, what is she doing here? What is she doing here? Brittany! Well, I figured we could all spend some time together. I would never spend time with this terrible girl. Yeah, Brett, this sucks. Your idea is terrible. Don't talk to my daughter like that. You can't tell me what to do. You're not my mom. Come on, guys, please. Can't we just enjoy this lunch together? No, this is stupid. This food is trash, just like your mother. That is it. Mom, take that. Oh, oh my gosh. Mom, did you seriously just throw a hot dog at her? Don't worry, Brittany. I will handle this. <laughs> Oh my goodness, what is the commotion? Oh no, my food! I'm sorry, Chef. My new daughter-in-law said your food was trash. <laughs> what? I did not. Liar, like the criminal you are. Oh, whoa, 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 wait a minute, criminal? I cannot have criminals in my restaurant. You're out of here. This isn't over, lady. Ha, looks like it is to me. Oh my gosh, Mom, don't you think that was a bit much? I think she deserves it. Well, this was a lovely lunch, Brittany. Mom, I did all this so you could get to know her. She really isn't that bad. Ha, she has you fooled, Brittany. She is the worst. Don't worry, you'll see soon enough. Look, I really think you need to talk to Mom. <laughs> no, I'm not talking to her. I'm mad at her. Why? Because she hates your wife? Exactly, Britt. And you need to talk to her. She's your mom, after all. Now tell me where you hid the money, Franklin. Ah! I didn't see no money! There were ten witnesses! I ain't telling you nothing, lady! <laughs> That's it, time for a time out! Uh-oh! Uh, put me down! Absolutely not! <laughs> Oh, kids, is everything okay? Mom, we're fine, but you two need to talk about this. Yeah, Mom, you need to be nice to my wife. Oh, let me think. Nope. Hey, Mom, come on. Look, I might not be the biggest fan of his wife either, but you guys have to get along. He loves her. Well, I want to show you two something. Come here. What is it? This footage. See, there she is, right there. I mean, it kind of looks like her. This 
criminal is wanted from Bloxburg to Brookhaven. Mom, that is not her. I've been following this crime for a long time. It is her. Mom, she is my wife, and I know it's not her. Hold on, I'm getting a call. Hello? Look, it's my wife. She needs me to pick her up. I'm out of here. Mom, do you think some of this has to do with the fact that he's spending more time with his wife and us now? What? No, I want him to get married, just not to a criminal. I have my eyes on her. It's about time. Let's go. What's with the money? It's so we can go on a shopping spree, okay? Ah, oh, sweet. I need some new shoes. Yeah, okay, cool. Come on. Somebody help. We've been robbed. Oh, my goodness. Mom, how many tacos did you make? Oh, I don't know. I think about... 300? 300? <laughs> what can I say? All right, well, I hope everyone eats all these. Party looks great, Mom. Why, thank you. Hey, Mom, what? Oh, my gosh. Surprise! Surprise, dear. What? What is all this? It's your birthday party! Oh, you guys shouldn't have. Yeah, you really shouldn't have. Uh... Why not? Because we're getting out of town. We leave in 10 minutes. Wait, why? Yeah, Natalie got me a trip for my birthday. Which is so much better than this. Now go pack Daniel. We don't want to be late. See, I told you. She's a monster. Whatever. I'm more important than the two of you now. And Daniel does whatever I want. Let me guess. You're trying to get out of town after you robbed the grocery store. Excuse me? I know it was you. Well, I don't want to be a part of this family. You're all trash. Oh, that is it. Take this. Ah, what the heck? Oh my gosh, mom. Whoa, babe, you got frosting all over your face. Ha, it was funny. She just slipped and fell into the cake. Daniel, we need to get out of here. Your mom is crazy. All right, well, thank you guys for the party. I'll catch you later. Oh my gosh, mom. I can't believe you threw cake at her. Don't you think you're taking this way too far again? No, that gives me an idea. I'm going to look into her family and see what their life. Did I have to come with you, Mom? Well, of course you did. Plus, I need a witness. <gasps> Wait a second. Oh my gosh. Is this her family's house? This can't be it. What is she, like, mega rich or something? Excuse me. Can I help the two of you off of my property? Are you Natalie's mom? I am. And who exactly are you? I'm Daniel's mother. And this is his sister. Oh, yes. Well, come in. Let's get this over with. Over with? What the heck? I just wanted to come here and talk to you about your daughter. Okay, well, how much money would you want? A million? What? No, we don't want your money. We just want to talk to you about her. Fine. Two million it is. I just want to tell you that your daughter is a criminal. <gasps> what is this? What are you doing here? I assumed these people wanted money. They look poor. Well, that's because they are poor, Mom. How dare you? We are not poor. Mom, this lady also thinks I'm a criminal. That is my daughter you're speaking about. Uh-oh. Get all the moms. You listen to me, lady. My daughter is no criminal. Why should I believe you? I would know. Now get out of my house immediately. Yeah, Mom, come on. Let's get out of here. All right. Are they gone? <laughs> I think they just left. Well, good. Here's your money. Ah, oh, perfect. Pleasure doing business with you. All right, I'm gonna beat this level so close. <laughs> Uh-oh, that is the sound of my mom crying. Where is it coming from? <laughs> it's just so far away. Just take a flight or something. It's not that bad. What's going on? Why is mom crying? Mean old Natalie is making them move far, far away. It's what my wife wants. Wait, no, you can't move far away. I want to be as far away from you all as possible. <laughs> oh my gosh, Bob. No, you just don't want to get caught for your crimes. Whatever with this criminal thing. Well, if you're taking him away, then how about you pack his bags? I need to speak with my children in private. Do you really want to move that far away? No. What else am I supposed to do? You could divorce her. Mom. No. What? It's the only option. All right. I don't feel like packing your things. We'll call mover. So come on. Time to go. Well, Daniel, we come visit you soon. I'm really going to miss you. Yeah, of course you can. See you guys later. Love you guys. Bye. Mom, do you really think she's moving him away on purpose? Oh, yeah. 100%. And I'm getting close to catching her. Wait, Mom, where are you going? I need to get down to the station and make some phone calls. Okay, bye. Wow, this town is really nice. There are tons of cute things to do here. Yeah, I really like living here. Wait a second. Hold on. Hello. Are we 
Oh dear. What is it, Mom? Someone just stole a car and the police chief has to have me come in. But Mom, no, we were gonna hang out today. I'll be back soon. Sorry, kiddos. That's really weird. Why would they call Mom? Well, honestly, she is like the best cop in all of Roblox, so I guess it makes sense. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Babe, what's this? Did you just get a new car? Yeah. How did you pay for this? <laughs> Isn't it awesome? I'm sure your rich mom bought it for you, right? <laughs> Rich mom? Her mom's not rich. No offense. This car's sick. I gotta check it out. Listen here, Brad. Stop asking questions and don't talk about my mom. Whoa. Uh, okay. Sorry? If you mention it to anyone, you'll be sorry. Whoa, babe. I can't get over it. This car is awesome. <laughs> I know, right? Brit, you want to drive it? Why? She could never afford one. She'll want what she could never have. Um, whoa. No, no, no. That was rude. Come on, Daniel. We need to go home now. Later. Okay. That was a strange reaction. <laughs> weird about this. You've been doing so well, I want to give you a promotion. Oh my gosh, really? Thank you so much. Well, I'll give you 10 extra cents an hour. Uh, oh. Oh, okay. And now that you're a shift leader, I think we need to hire a new employee. All right. Well, I wonder who we're going to hire. I should tell my best friend Sophie, but... Oh my gosh. Hey, Britt. Natalie, what are you doing here? Look, I need a job. Is this place hiring? Wait, you want a job here? Oh my gosh, did I hear that correct? Someone wants a job? Yeah, it was me. <laughs> oh, excellent. Here's an application. Oh, I forgot a pen. Let me go get you one. But you guys just moved super far away from here. So what? I don't mind. Hi, honey. Oh, <gasps> what is she doing here? None of your business, you old hag. You better watch your tone, young lady. Okay, no, 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 no. I cannot have you two fighting at my job. All right. Well, I couldn't find a pen in. Oh, hey, Mrs. Cop lady. Hi, Roosevelt. Good to see you again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, when can you start, lady? You cannot hire this woman. Eh, why not? Because she is a criminal. I know, I'm a police officer. Well, ma'am, do you have any evidence? Well, not exactly. I I'm working on that. <laughs> I think it's rude. You should get out of here and stop blaming people for things they haven't done yet. Yeah, I agree with my new employee. Get out, woman. Hey, that's my mom. Yeah, well, your mom's out of control. All right, door is unlocked and wait a second. Natalie? Oh, hi. What are you doing? Oh, I'm just... Um, counting the money, you know, before the day starts. That's my job. Don't you start tomorrow? Jeez, Britt, just chill out, okay? Must have got my schedule wrong. Okay, that's so weird. Let me just check something really quick. <gasps> oh my gosh, the money, it, it's, it's all gone. Did she just freeze right there, criminal? Excuse me? Yeah, we got a call that someone was robbing this place. No, 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 officer. Trust me, you've got this all wrong. There was no one here besi ha! besides you. So you're admitting to it. No, it was my brother's wife in here. Well, uh, I don't see any of your brother's wife, whatever she may look like. No, 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 she was here. I promise. Yeah, yeah, likely story. All right, you're under arrest. No, officer, I swear I didn't do it. What about the stolen car outside? I, I don't even have a car. Okay, what's the meaning of this? This woman is a criminal. We got reports she's stealing from your business. I just promoted her too. Unbelievable. No, is this a dream? Can someone please tell me this is a dream? It's a criminal's nightmare. Officer, arrest this criminal. Come on, you heard the man. I don't believe this. You have this all wrong. Ha! You think I haven't heard this before? Trust me, officer, she is real. Yeah, is she also the tooth fairy? Come on, you're going into your cell, criminal. Ridiculous. Now stay in there until you can come up with the truth. That cop won't listen to me, but I'm telling the truth. But isn't all that smart? Because he didn't even take my phone. Hey, mom. Oh, hold on one second. What is it, dear? I'm busy at work. I got arrested. You did what? I've been framed, mom. I need your help. I'll be right there. I'm sorry, Bernie, but my daughter needs me. But my car. Learn how to drive better. Well, my mom should be here any minute now. Brittany, mom. Now, who arrested you? It was that officer over there. Jackson? Wait, you're the most famous cop here. Yes, that is me and you arrested my daughter. But, but officer, she, she was at the scene of the crime. Yeah, don't you get it by now? I was being framed. Yeah, by some fake sister-in-law. She is real, sir. And she's on the loose. Now get out of here and find her. She's a criminal. Uh, yes, ma'am. Right away. Now, are you sure? 
Or it was her. Yeah, mom. She was counting all the money in the register and then poof, she was gone. Along with the money. She's on the run, but she'll strike again and we'll catch her. Mom, are you sure this is her next heist? I'm sure of it. She should be here any minute. All right. <gasps> look, look over there. Dang it, it's not her. It's some old lady. I just don't get why old people love the bank so much. I don't know. They're always at the bank for some reason. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Mom, look, look. What are we doing standing here, lady? Let's go in and get her. No, no, no. Patience, dear. She needs to commit her crime first. I don't want to wait. Oh, no. Oh, the tower. Uh, was that old lady scream our cue? Yes, yes, it was. Let's go. Stop right there. Ugh, not this again. Get out of my way. No way. You got my daughter arrested. You're going to pay. <laughs> yeah, right. Take this. <laughs> oh my gosh, Mom, are you okay? Oh, oh no, oh, she's stealing the car. Oh, oh my goodness, ouch. Where in creation did she get that taser? She probably stole it. Oh, just like she steals everything else. Wow, my brother's new neighborhood is like wicked nice. Ahem, <clears throat> excuse me. A poor girl, you need to get out of my neighborhood. Okay, bro, that was really rude. I'm going to call the police. Okay, well, I'm running out of time. I need to find my brother. Hey, is anybody home? Door's unlocked. Place is sick, I love it. Hey, Daniel, are you home? Well, I left the TV on. Hold on, something doesn't feel right. Uh, I gotta call my mom. Mom? Um, I've got some bad news. Daniel's missing. But it's football day. I know, Mom. That's what's like really weird about this whole thing. I'm at his house and he's nowhere to be found. That means Natalie must have taken him somewhere. Go hack into their computer and see if you can find anything. All right, Mom. I I'm on it. Okay, I feel really bad just like creeping through my brother's house, but this is important. The guest bedroom. Perfect. The computer. All right. What do we got here? Gotta have security cameras. <gasps> here we go. It was her. All right, so I'm gonna download that footage and make sure I keep it so that way I have evidence. But I gotta get to the garage and free my brother. Don't worry, Daniel, I'm coming. Daniel! Uh, Britt, hey. Can't believe this. I saw in the security footage that Natalie locked you in here. Yeah, she told me she needed me out of the way to do something. Dude, she is a criminal. Oh, come on, you sound like mom. She got me arrested. Whoa, really? All right, that's not cool. Nobody gets my sister arrested. Come on, hop in the car. Okay, do you know where she is? Oh yeah, I know exactly where she is. She's leaving the country, I just know it. Well, we gotta get to her fast. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <gasps> there she is. Hey, babe. Ah! Who let you out? I let myself out. Well, with Brit's help. Yeah, you're not getting away with this, Natalie. <laughs> I already have. You're too late, losers. Wait, we gotta stop her. Right, we can't just hop on a plane. Yes, we can. Come on, pilot. Let's get out of here. You're not going anywhere. No, a lady, get away from me. Get back here. Get out of my way. No way, we're not moving. Oh, I finally caught you, criminal. <laughs> way, way to go, mom. Now, do you believe me, Daniel? <laughs> I didn't believe you before, but now I do. Nat, I want a divorce. Whatever, you're dumb and ugly anyways. Wait, so you never loved me? No, I just wanted to marry a cop's son so I could get away with my crimes. Well, you have messed with the wrong family lady. That's right. Now, come on, time for jail. You should stay in the palace, your majesty. You can't tell me what to do. Wait a minute. Who is she? I gotta go meet her. Never seen anyone like that before. Whoa, 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 whoa. Watch it, dude. I'm, I'm sorry, I th thought you were a streetlight. Guard, throw this peasant in the dungeon. Uh, say what now? Right away, sir. What? Wait, no. Now, is this love at first sight? Sophie, you did it! Great job! So, ma'am, how did she do? You ruined everything. And I'd like to speak to the manager. Get lost, lady! I don't want to see your big forehead ever again. I'll be back for you, you brat. Soph, come on! We're totally gonna get in trouble by the manager. Come on, Brett. The rules shouldn't apply to Karens. Ahem! I told ya I'd be back. Oh no, the walking forehead is back. She brought the prince with her. So ma'am, what happened? These two gave me the worst service in the entire universe. No, ma'am, my friend and I said we would fix it. Ma'am, look at this girl here. She's the most beautiful thing I have ever seen. Aww, 
Thanks! You're so nice! Huh? What? No, not you. Your friend. Thank you. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Now do something about this! You're pretty much the manager of Blacksburg, so lock him away! You're awful, lady. Well, how about you have to visit the dungeon? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Prince. Ah, don't lock me in the dungeon! Oh my goodness, thank you so much for saving us and not throwing us in the dungeon. But I, uh, I actually gotta go. But before I leave, would you want to go on a date with me? Sure, I, I, I don't see why not. Woohoo, yeah, awesome. All right, I'll catch you later. Oh my gosh, girl, am I going on a date with the prince? Do you know who that prince is? Yeah, he, he's Prince Dylan of Bloxburg. Yeah, but do you know what else they call him? No. The most evil, spoiled, and mean prince in the world! Oh, come on, Soph. He doesn't seem that bad. I'm sure it's just a bad reputation. Whoa, this place is super cute. I've been dying to come here. Thanks for taking me. Yeah, of course. Waiter! Best table now! Right away, sir. Majesty, uh, here you go. Oh, cool. Bro, no. This table is horrible. I want a better one. Okay, um, how about this one? They're all kind of the same. Dylan, th this table is perfectly fine. This one's acceptable. So, uh, what would you two like to eat? I would like lime cot halibut right this instant. We don't exactly sell seafood. Dude, come on. You're awful. Hey, they don't have it. That's okay. Um, sir, I'd love a cappuccino if you have it. Yeah, right away. I'll, uh, try to go fishing or, or something. We'll be right back. Dylan, is everything okay? You kind of seem on edge a little bit. What do you mean? I talk to everyone like that. But you don't really talk to me that way. That's because you're different. Here you go, miss. Perfect. Thank you. But what do you mean I'm different? I don't know. You're, you're kind of Perfect. I really like you. Whoa, 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 um, Dylan, you're nice and all, but we just met. I, I think maybe you should pump the brakes a little and we should get to know each other as friends first. Okay, sure, but like only because you said so. Sir, I tried fishing, but I only found this. Dude, this is not what I ordered at all. Guard! Dungeons, 16th one today. Take him away. Right away, sir. No! Okay, that is ridiculous. I cannot believe leave you. What? He gave me the wrong thing. He was trying his best and you should maybe try to be nice to people. You know what? On second thought, I I'm good. Do you mind paying for the coffee? Because I'm out of here. This is ridiculous. Hey, wait up. It was so embarrassing, Sophie. He was just so rude. And I said, yeah, he is the rudest. Not expecting anyone. I wonder who it could be. You. Hey, uh, I just wanted to talk to Brittany. So if, it's okay. I, I'll talk to him. What do you have to say for yourself? That I'm sorry. You were being totally rude. I, I know, but could you give me another chance maybe? I mean, I still really have a crush on you. Look, uh, that's nice and all, but honestly, no, I... I don't think we're really compatible. What? I, I don't understand. Being rude is not a good look on anyone. I, I'm trying, seriously, but I just, I don't know how. Well, maybe I can help. And I think I know just the person to help me. Seriously? Come on in. Oh, fine. So yeah, dude, this is my place. Well, huh, the decorations are so gross. Whoa, 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 you're doing this all wrong. You don't just come into someone's house and start critiquing it. I don't know, maybe start with a compliment. Like, hey, Sophie, super cute plant. Aw, hey, thanks, girl. Dylan, try it. Hey, Soph, nice rug. Looks like a, a rug. This isn't just a rug. This is an heirloom. I've had it. I've had it. Get out. Seriously? All I ever do is mess up. This is bogus. Oh, man. That guy is seriously the worst. Honestly, so at least it was a start. Brett, he's always going to be a jerk. That's never going to change. 
So the guard that let me in said that Dylan was in the throne room? Sounds like he's having a meeting with the king. You've thrown nearly half the town in the dungeon. We are running out of space. Explain yourself. Yeah, but they like made me mad, okay? Bro, you can't just lock people up that you don't like. Dylan really is an evil prince. Well said, my son. Why can't you be more like your brother? Why can't you be more understanding? You better change your ways soon, young man. Whatever. Well, if you don't, I will take that crown away. Are you serious? I am not bluffing. Straighten up. Brit, what are you doing here? I actually came to talk to you. Let's go outside so we can do that. Come on. So you heard all that, huh? Yeah, I'm sorry. That was kind of harsh. Yeah, it's whatever. <laughs> but hey, about what your dad said in there, I can help you change your ways. You just gotta try, okay? This means you haven't given up on me, huh? <laughs> Not in the least. And look, on the bright side, you already made one friend, and it's me. Look at what you did. Look, lady, if you don't scram in five seconds. Are you threatening me? Beat it, lady. Count yourself lucky, but you're gonna regret it, trust me. Oh, come on. I think Sophie's working today. Hey, Soph, I brought Dylan to do an apology. It's his first ever, so just hear him out. Wait, before you apologize, let's do a little test, shall we? Want some ice cream? Please, vanilla? Coming right up. See, Dylan, it's not that hard to be nice to people. Here is your vanilla ice cream. This is completely wrong. Are you kidding me? Dylan, remember what you're trying to do? You're trying to be nice. Yeah, I'm waiting. Oh, right. Uh, hey, look, that was the wrong ice cream. But, uh, thank you anyway. Yay! <laughs> See? Not that bad. I am impressed. All right, I'm gonna take my break. I wanna hang out with you guys. Well, me and Britt are gonna go to the club later. Do you maybe wanna come with us? Yeah, Dylan, you totally should. It'll be super fun. So sounds fun. Oh, I need to run home real quick. I need to get my roller skates. Uh, what the heck? You're finally home, eh? Ma'am, I'm gonna need you to get out of my house. Get out of my house? This is mine, you crazy lady. I'm never leaving. This is all mine. This is my house now. <laughs> ah! oh, where is she? Where is she? I mean, Sophie's late, but she's never this late. Yeah, where is she? Something's wrong. We should go check on her. So, hello? What do you want? What are you doing at my friend's house? This is my house. Wait, what? Uh, no, ma'am, this is Sophie's house. Yeah, you need to go. I refuse to listen to any of you. Now get lost. <laughs> Wait a minute, I hear Sophie. She's stuck inside somewhere. We gotta save her. Is there another way inside her house? I, I think so. I'll go find it. You distract Karen. Yeah, good idea. Hey, hey, hey you. What are you doing in my house? This isn't your house. And you know what? I'm not gonna leave. Look who I found. Ah! Uh-oh, uh, guys, we should probably run this. Woman is crazy. Ah, yeah, she is terrifying. Uh, Dylan, come on, we should probably get out of here. And stay out, you brats. At least you're freed. Guys, I have an idea. Dad, Dad, hey. What is it, son? Some crazy Karen stole Sophie's house. We're kind of wondering if there's any way you can help us out. Well, you've helped my son. I'll dispatch some guards at once. Awesome, thank you.